Make some noise for ASAP Ferb! Hoo, 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 hoo! Gucci down to the socks like a Biggie Papa! Hey, Ferg, what up, man? Just bought a new shovel. Damn. Ladies and gentlemen, the Hood Pope is here. What's up, y'all? How y'all feeling? Can I get some energy in here? I need some energy. You feel yeah, that? Man. You feel that love, What's up, man? Bonics? Uh, welcome to Portland, man. Yeah, man, it feels good. What do you know about Portland, back. man? Do you got any stories about Portland, or you got um, you got like five girlfriends here? What do you got? Uh, hey, man, listen, I, I I do the I do the Adidas thing. You know, I'm signed to Adidas, and we got the shoes out. Um, we about to yeah, repping Adidas. Oh, man, yeah, you know, I mean, sure. I still I, I'm, a, I'm a stylish dude, uptown. so I could yeah, this I'm repping Uptown right now. But yeah, uh, Adidas headquarters is out here, so I come out here and go shopping all the time and get stuff. Can I get the plug or what? I got I mean, you, bro. You know what I mean. I got you. Right. Just you don't run it. off on the plug. All right. <laughs> uh, well, once again, welcome to Portland, man, where weed is legal. How do you feel about that, man? I don't smoke weed, so I wouldn't. Really? Know. Yeah. You don't smoke weed? Uh uh. Really? No. Nope. You got a question? No Fonto leaf? You, you uh. do the liquor? Um, I drink liquor. I drink liquor. I drink wine. Have you ever smoked weed before? Yeah, I smoked weed before. What was your first time smoking weed like? And why don't you smoke weed? Uh, my first time smoking weed would have to be, uh, I think it was like my. 17, no, 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 like my, I was young. <laughs> I was like 15, I think, I smoked weed for my birthday, and I was like in the park doing cartwheels after that. <laughs> I like yeah, and I don't smoke weed just because I can't, like, it's real strong, I can't, maybe I haven't found a strand that I can handle or something like that. Right, you drink? It's just really strong. You yeah, like I drink, drink sometimes. What, what, yeah. what kind of liquor do you, do you drink? Um, I drink wine, preferably, like, you know, red Sophisticated wine. Sophisticated yeah. man over here, you know? Yeah. You're uh, currently on the Turnt and Burnt tour, right? Yeah, we getting turnt till we burnt. Chill Rob Stone. How's how's that tour going, man? Oh, it's dope, man. Like, um, just to be on tour with Rob Stone and, and Young Cardi is is just amazing. It's like it's like a new energy, it's a resurgence. Um, you know, we've been selling out every show. It's been like crazy. Now, what's great is that I've seen you a few times. We got the tour a few times together. Right. And uh, the last time I seen you was in Europe. Describe the difference between Europe crowds and then, you know, the U.S. crowds, man. Um, the difference between Europe crowds is that they don't get to see you as much, so they just go extra stupid bananas every time they see you. They treat you like Michael Jackson or like they just seen, like, Obama or something. Like, for real, they come to the... Uh, sh they come to your shows with flowers and T-shirts and I stuff. I mean, it's because hip-hop's truly American, right? It was born in America, so, like, when they see hip-hop over there, it's like... But I mean, it's really good here too. It's just like it's more reality here. It's like you uh, when you go to an LA show or like you go like New York. They, you I know so much people in New York already. It's like I got fans there, but it's like a lot of friends. They like, what's up, Ferg? They in the crowd. They like saying, what's up? Like, you know what I'm saying? So <laughs> you didn't call me. Exactly. Right. They actually come to the show so they could get your new number. Like, right, shit right, like that. Uh, so congratulations on Always Strive and Prosper, your album that came out earlier this year. I appreciate year. it, man. Uh, I love the Missy Elliott joint and what you were trying oh, to do strive. there, man. Yeah, I appreciate it, Really man. one of my favorite joints. Appreciate it. Um, but uh, a lot of talk on you got a new project, and i seen that you may or may not have posted something with Alchemist, who's one of the best producers Yeah, shout right out now. to Alchemist. What's the, what's the new project looking like? Uh, the new project is called Still Striving, and it should be out very, very, very soon. I mean, I'm talking about like a couple weeks soon. So look out for that. Hey. Yeah, and I got a lot of bangers on there. I'm going back to like the whole trap lord sound that's gonna be. Damn. Yeah. Uh what cozy tapes? Let's talk about that. Cozy tapes is fire. Who crazy, got cozy crazy. tapes? Make some noise. Woo. Of course yeah. it got the homie Wiz on it. So I Yeah, of course. Oh, that that Chuck. back and forth with him and Rocky was crazy. Crazy. And it got yeah. that whole bone. That feel, was a surprise because I didn't even hear that one. Like that just that he just Put through that out on me. If I, you know, and I wonder if they were in the studio together because they had to be. Had to it be, was right, too right. right. It was. It felt too right. They had to be like they had to be in the booth together. Cause me and Rocky do that all the time. Like we'll go in a booth and we'll just be like, he be like, like we'll be fighting for the mic because it's like we got a, a a rhyme that goes with the last line. And I could imagine him and Wiz was doing the same thing. 
Right, all high as hell, yeah. though. Right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, now nah, they sound like they was on point. Them verses right. are serious. Sound like a bone, like you know when they go yeah, into that whole like bone, bone thing. Yeah. Uh, so the cozy tapes, man. Uh, how was that process? Big shout out to Hector, the homie. Yeah, Hector Delgado. Uh, the man, yeah. like the joint that uh, the the Onyx sample on there. Is yeah, really that cool. was crazy, and he did Yamagini High too. Right, right. Yeah, he's like he's my my engineer, Rocky's engineer. He like he's coming with the heat. Like he got some crazy beats. Yeah. And it's like out of nowhere, I'm like, yo, where you coming up with these ideas? Big shout out to Hector, man. You always got to shout out to those dudes. Big shout out to your DJ, too, TJ Mizzle, man. Yeah, making TJ some noise. Mazel, yep. Jam He's, Master J. Son. Yeah, Jam Master J. Son. Yeah. He, uh, you know, been a homie a as well. And just, you know, I've seen artists who have great DJs, and right. I've seen artists who have, you know, button pushers. So definitely got to shout out to You know why I love TJ? TJ? Because he really brings something to the table. Like, he's not just a DJ that just, like, you know, there being... Like you said, like a robot just pressing buttons. He's he actually brought like the whole EDM like wave to my brand because before then I was just getting like before like right before I started like doing all of these big festivals, he like was like yo telling me about Skrillex and uh, Carnage and all of these guys and I didn't know any I didn't know about none of them. I only knew Skrillex because I was in a video a while for the night with Rocky <laughs> right, right. and Dr. But before that I didn't know about like all these other guys and he kind of put me on to all of these guys and it was it was easy to collaborate with them because I was familiar with their music after that. So dope, man. Congratulations on all the yeah. success. What can people expect tonight at the uh Turnt and Burnt tour? Will will all you guys be there? I hope so. Yeah. Um you're gonna expect like some real, real, real like turned up shit, like a lot of energy. It's gonna be a lot of mosh pitting, it's gonna be a lot of crowd surfing. It's gonna be a ASAP show, it's gonna be a party. It ain't gonna be like no bougie ass celebrity shit. Where I'm on stage just thinking I'm too cute to party with the people. I'm really gonna come out there and really mess with y'all. You're gonna get some water, you're gonna get wet. So uh all the ladies that wanna wear heels and stuff, y'all better be on the balcony because like on the floor is going down. You can expect a lot of energy. I can't wait to hear that. Oh, and some dope-ass merch. You know, oh, this yeah, is my man. new jackets What's and up? stuff to turn them burn. What's up, man? Can I designed I get... it all myself. How can I get down, man? So you owe I me some Adidas. You. you owe me some merch. Damn, bro. You good, just... What about what you owe me? Shit. <laughs> Can uh, I get a can I get a spin of a set or something? I will do it. We'll do. It. I'm gonna. Right. Well, you guys, all right? If I come DJ at a show tonight, how about a whiz verse? Oh, wanna, <laughs> let's do it, man. Uh, one time, uh, Portland, make some noise for ASAP Ferg. Make sure you cop the cozy tapes. Look out for his next project. Can we expect a, a new single or Wednesday? Hey, the next make sure y'all cop the Always Strive and Prosper in store right now. If y'all ain't got it, yeah, that's still new too. You gotta Definitely. promote that. Hey, by the way, uh, work remix just went platinum. Hey. And, uh, and new, uh, your new level went gold. New level went gold, right? Yeah, Congratulations, exactly. man! Thank your first you, gold record, ladies and yeah. gentlemen. No, that's first. my second. Oh, it's your second. Yeah, the first. The first, I think, is uh, I think. What what's the first? Oh, work. No, yeah, no work, no. work, 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 right, right, exactly. right. Well, first go off gold the before you go platinum, right? right. Well, the first <laughs> of this of this album. Exactly. So I just corrected yeah. myself.